In this illustration, we intend to calculate the maximum deflection of the beam using the strength of materials and abacus software and compare the results obtained from the abacus software with those of the strength of materials subsequently. As you observe in this picture, a 300 newton force is applied to the end of the beam and we intend to calculate the deflection of the beam due to the force of 300 newton. The length of the beam is 1 meter and the cross section of the beam is 1 square with a side equal to 0 0.02 meters. I will enter the abacus software for simulation. I will click on create part. I intend to create geometric shape of the beam. I will select the modeling space as 3D from here, deformable, via and planner. Enter approximate size equal to 5 and continue. I will draw a horizontal line. As you observe in this picture, the beam is 1 meter in length. done in the next step i will enter property module click on create material here i intend to define the properties of steel i will click on mechanical menu on elasticity and elastic young modulus is equal to 200 gigapascal i will enter young modulus equal to 200 multiplied by 10 to the power of 9 pascal poisson ratio is equal to 0 0.3 and ok I will click on create section from here select beam then beam again continue then click on create beam profile then select rectangular and continue the cross section of the beam is one square and each side of it is equal to 0 0.02 meters I will click on assign section, select the beam, done, and OK. In the next step, I will click on assign beam orientation, select the beam, done, press on enter button, and OK. Here you can observe the three-dimensional shape of the beam. In the next step, I will enter assembly module. Click on create instance and OK. Then I will enter step module. Click on create step. Here select static general and continue. Time period is equal to one second. Since this problem is linear by nature, I will select OFF option. OK. I will enter LOAD module. Click on CREATE BOUNDARY CONDITION. Select INITIAL STEP, then DISPLACEMENT ROTATION and CONTINUE. I will select this point, DONE, and close all boundary conditions of displacement. As you observe in this picture, the left end part of the beam is absolutely fixed. I will click on Create Load, select Step 1, then Concentrated Force, and Continue. I will select this point, Done. I will enter Force equal to negative 300 Newton, and OK. Enter approximate global size equal to 0 0.01 meters and OK. I will click on mesh part and yes. Here I will put element family on beam. OK. In the next step I'll enter step module. Click on tools menu then on set and create. Name this set deflection. 
continue select this point and done actually we intend to calculate the deflection of this point in the next step i will click on create history output continue here select set and then deflection in the next step i'll select u2 or the same vertical displacement and okay here I will save the model. I will enter job module. Click on create job. Continue. OK. And then click on submit. The analysis was done successfully, so I'll click on Result. Here you can observe the deflection of the beam. Here, the problem has been solved using the strength of materials. To solve this problem utilizing the strength of materials formula, first, we should draw the free diagram of the beam, meaning that we should draw all the forces and moments having been applied to the beam. After that, we should write the relation of moment. As you observe, moment depends on x after that we should integrate this relation twice in order to calculate deflection and having calculated the integral and simplified the relations we will get to this relation pl to the power of 3 divided by 3 EI and we use this formula for calculating the quantity of deflection. P stands for force and is equal to 300 Newton. L is the length of the bar that is equal to 1 meter. E is the Young modulus of steel that is equal to 200 multiplied by 10 to the power of 9 Pascal. I stands for the second moment of area and here the formula of second moment of area can be clearly observed. The maximum deflection of the beam is equal to 0 0.0375 meters. Now we intend to calculate the maximum deflection of the beam using the Abacus software. I will click on Create XY Data, select ODB History Output and continue. Here I will select the deflection and click on Save As. As you observe, the maximum deflection having been obtained from the Abacus software is equal to 0 0.0375 meters. As it can be observed, the results obtained from the Abacus software are so close to those of strength of materials, indicating that those having been obtained from the Abacus software are exactly concordant with those of the strength of materials and in both cases, 
the maximum deflection of the beam is equal to 0 0.0375 meters. Here you can also observe deflection of the beam using colored contours. And as it can be observed in this picture, the deflection of the beam having been marked with blue color is equal to 3.751 multiplied by 10 to the power of negative 2 meters.